Introduction. 13th of May 2023, 7.29pm. We were ready. Well, I say that. Not quite ready. You have to take into account that this was the opening night of previews. So although it was our first time performing Aspects of Love to a paying audience, the show wasn't locked. We'd use those days of previews to fine-tune it, make it ready for press night. So, sort of ready. Or as ready as we'd ever be. Considering. At the warm-up, before the theatre opened and the audience assembled, I'd made a little speech. I'd reminded the company how good they were and how much we loved the show. If everybody loved it as much as we did, we couldn't lose. We had a surefire hit on our hands. The safety curtain came down and we retreated to our various backstage hidey holes as the audience took their seats. Out front was my partner, Cathy, texting me to say she was in place wishing me luck. Most of the cast had family and friends present. Later on, I saw Jamie Boggio's dad wearing a badge that said, Jamie's dad. It was that kind of atmosphere, a big old bundle of raw nerves, anticipation and goodwill. And if the rest of the company was jangling, then what did that make me? This, after all, was my baby. 34 years ago, I'd headed the cast of Aspects in the West End, and now I was returning to the show that had made my name. Nervous? You might say that. Showtime. And down in my dressing room, I awaited my entrance call, feeling and indeed feeding off those legendary first night nerves, but having every faith in the brilliant cast and company, in the production as a whole and in the material. My faith was repaid. It went well. Really bloody well. As the show ended, we were treated to a standing ovation, the praises of a beaming Lord of the Realm, spoiler, it was Andrew Lloyd Webber, and a producer who was as pleased as punch. We all had pizza in the bar, out by the stalls, and then we went home, knowing that our run had begun and that this, the Lyric Theatre in London's glittering West End, was to be our home for the next six months. Except, of course, it didn't work out like that. And if you don't know what I'm talking about when I say it didn't work out like that, then keep listening. We have a great twist ending in store. And if you do, then keep listening anyway, because although you already know the twist, this is about the journey, not the destination. A biography not just of me, thank God, but of a musical a tale of how Aspects of Love, a weird and very wonderful show, has changed my life, not once, but twice. A story that includes as many downs as it does ups, because at the end of the day, that's showbiz. Ready? Sort of? Well, ready as you'll ever be. <laughs>